Happy birthday. Happy birthday. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't even say happy birthday when we were on just now. How are you? I guess I'm not supposed to be saying happy birthday, am I? <laughs> no, but we are supposed to say happy birthday. I'm just waiting for it to come up live because we are live, but I know that it takes a little bit of time to actually come up. And it was a bit confusing, I know. For some people, they connected to the other live stream but let's have a look. Oh, yes. And it's the right orientation. Do you see that, Jen? It's vertical? Yeah. Well, it's vertical. We're both vertical. I'm not sure if I did this right, but it's going to have to be what it is right now. We're Are you okay with that? Do you see it? I do see it. Okay. 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 And I hear a, a, a um, what do you call it? An echo. I'm not sure if you've got something else which is on. Let me go. Okay, I'm going to swipe up and then see. Hopefully, you're not going to. Hey, Tash. Tash says, looks good. Hey, C. Happy birthday, Jen. Do you hear me, Jen? I think you muted your phone. <coughs> is Jen still there? Let's wave and see if Jen is still there. I'm, I'm still, still here. here. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, I tried closing stuff, so I don't know if that helped. No, no, I think you're. I think you're good. It's just there's just a little bit of a, like as if you've got another device, not your phone because we need your phone audio, but another device. Can you turn that down? Can you see comments? Uh, I can see comments. Um, okay, whenever I swiped it away. You didn't see me or hear me, like whenever I tried to, I went okay. and closed Instagram. Well, that was like, that's better your, when you just talked now. Hi, Louisa. Hello, Sarah. Oh, <laughs> Louisa says, why we square format? Well, I think we did it. I did it wrong. So it should have been the other way around. But um, yeah, it's just going to have to be like this for today. Sorry, Louisa. <laughs> I just realized something. I may have to be painting through the camera to see because it the way that it's oriented. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to see my page. Oh <laughs> so do you wanna yeah. adjust? Do you wanna adjust it? Um yeah, I don't know. Let me try sitting. So I've learned that yeah, I had to relearn how to set up my table because the table that I'm using the arm doesn't cut ah okay it's, it's got a curve to the left okay I'm sitting in my chair and I can lean a little bit and look under the camera <laughs> well, okay. do you want to do you want to move it can you tilt your camera so that you're like oh can you move your camera to the side and then ha have the camera facing? Oh, sorry. Like, yeah. Well, I'm going to get started because if not, I won't get this done. Um, what are you doing for your birthday, Jen? I am painting with y'all. <laughs> Louisa says, wow, it's like you're both herding cats. Thanks, Louisa. Um, yeah, cats are pretty hard to herd and don't have that skill and I feel like I am constantly doing that <laughs> no it feels like I woke up to a party with everybody saying happy birthday I hear you yeah I hear your voice sometimes and then it disappears like okay. I don't know well sitting down in the chair kept you from hearing my voice so is this better yeah a little bit better I think so okay, okay well um I will do this so I'm standing up and my head's kind of to the side, so we'll see how I end up painting. Maybe a very abstract, whatever. <laughs> so apparently, I'm going to be using uh, six by eight. I pulled from my stash of my stack of um, already cut. cut. I'll show you my stack stack of cut papers and canvases for my chairs. I counted out a hundred. I just happened to pull from that this morning. So I guess I'll be using that to paint with. Um, 
Oh, that doesn't, doesn't work. work. I just tried changing my orientation. I don't know why it's square. Louisa, I need some I need some help with YouTube and having lives. I guess we should have thought about this beforehand. Um, I think I need some kind of warm up. So I'm not good at doing people cold turkey like, like this, and okay, I haven't been do you, doing you people. Okay, do you want to do a warm-up beforehand? Yes, I want to do a warm-up. Um, okay. And I've got to figure out how to say it. Can everybody hear Jen? I'm having a hard time hearing Jen for some reason. I'm so sorry. Um, no, no, it's not. It's not. I don't know why your phone isn't picking up your voice, because you can't be very far from, a, from, from your phone, right? It's like four inches. Louisa says, we hear Jen is either louder or softer than Shah. <laughs> she says, my Padlet is not working, so I will watch and listen, <laughs> LOL. Oh, it's a great morning. Okay, let's do a warm-up. Okay. I'm going to do a warm-up with just a permanent marker. Okay. I'm and and uh, because I have to also rearrange the composition. <laughs> Because I'm just doing portrait. I'm not doing full body. Okay. Okay, I'm writing in blue because I'm drawing in blue. Okay, what are we doing? A warm up of the portrait? Or something else? Yeah, I'm yeah. doing a warm up of you. I'm going to do a three minute, three minute continuous line. Okay. <laughs> oh, this is so strange drawing me. Okay, <laughs> go. Yeah, I feel like maybe you have um, another device on that has sound on. I'm not sure um, because I can hear like me in the background in your in your location. Uh huh. So I'm not sure what it is. I think te it, there's tech issues. Um, I want probably on both sides. I've set it up wrong. Maybe maybe it's my fault. Well. Let me think through. I've oh, oh continuous oh, um, to think and draw uh, myself at the same time. <laughs> at the same time as tech. <laughs> no, as I'm trying to root. Yeah, I'm trying to remember. Poor Axel doesn't look quite right here. Um, well, whenever I do Zoom, yeah, yeah. there you would have to turn. Like it mattered, like which thing was cut on. And I learned what to do with Zoom, but I don't know where to do that on. Um, so now things. when you're talking right now, it sounds great. But I can hear me in the background when I talk. So what is that? I don't know. It sounds like a conversation in some sense. So it seems <laughs> yeah, I can hear an echo of me. I don't know. <laughs> oh my goodness. It's okay. We'll just keep drawing. What are you up to for your birthday? Um, getting a kitchen drawing correct. I know that. <laughs> you doing work today? Yeah, I've got to. I don't have a choice. <laughs> I will be doing that, but I don't know what else. So everybody ends up having to work on the birthday whenever. Oh, um, Louisa is asking, do you have headphones on, Lu do you have headphones on, Jen? No, I do not. Okay. Good morning, Annette. And then um, Julie says, can I see send you the image if you like? Oh, hang on. What is that? Julie says, see, can I send you the image if you like on Instagram? Oh, yes. Okay. And... Um, Louisa says, are you listening to YouTube on the phone? Um, I don't know. How would I know? How can I find out? Well, I have my phone on live, Louisa. Is that what it is? Because I can't have it on. Can I have it on the other device? Is that is one? That Maybe it's mine. Maybe it's because it's a jewel and that's it changes it. But I can hear like rain and cars and everything. <laughs> oh, I like yours, Jen. Oh, 
Mm. How are you two communicating? I can hear Jen on my phone. Now Jen has frozen. Oh no, Jen's probably like, this is too much. I'm not coming. I'm not doing drawing anymore. No, I'm not saying that. <laughs> um, are you kidding me? Oh, that's a cute picture of me. Of you, of your, your picture of me. <laughs> and um, I love yours. Um, when I just, when you said you couldn't see me, I looked up and like my screen had gone blank. You know how it does? Like if you don't. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Oh. <laughs> so funny. Louisa says because it's someone's playback that is feeding through. Would it be mine? I'm just I just have my live on my phone and that's it. If I didn't have I have everything else is muted. Okay, here's something that I learned is whenever I tap the link to join. Yeah. Um, it only accessed it through well I only tried it through the Instagram link and then I tapped it and it said that it would only work on a phone um, so I wonder if there's a double oh that's strange hmm good morning Meryl Louisa okay. says Thursday is the new Wednesday. Okay, I'm gonna get started with your with your actual portrait. Okay. Here's oh, there. and look what C gave me for my birthday. Look, it arrived. I sorry, I have it on, but can you see it? What is it probably it? will come up in a minute. It's a little. It's a coffee warmer. <laughs> you see that? It's a coffee warmer, so I don't have any cold coffee anymore. I love it. I got to move things separately, though. Thank you, C. I know. Brilliant, brilliant. Um, okay, I noticed something when I minimized YouTube just <laughs> then. Um, the, the yellow, you know how you have the green on your phone, like if your phone is going? Yeah. In the top left corner? My microphone was yellow, so I guess I'm using the phone, the microphone through my phone. But I, it told me whenever I cut on the the link, it said that I needed to set the my phone so that it would go to my settings for my phone to access the microphone and put it on. So I did. So it, that seems like that's happening, and that might be what needs to happen, but. So have... the only device you have on right now is your phone? Yes, that's the only one. So how do you see comments? Do you see comments or not? I do see comments here below the picture. Oh, but through your phone, right? Yes, it's below the, the image where I see the video. So it looks like it's YouTube. Hmm. <laughs> um Louisa says because it's someone's playback that's feeding through and um, <laughs> Louisa says Thursday is the new Wednesday and C says Wednesday on steroids. Oh, dear. <laughs> okay. It's fine. They're just having a laugh at us. That's right. I'm turning 54. I'm not turning tacky. <laughs> oh, like I love that. <laughs> that should be a card. I'm turning 54. I'm not turning techy. I love it. Everybody write it down. There you go. Okay. Um, Y'all were an influence on me in two ways for purchasing things lately. Many ways. The other ways. I bought some of this, the watercolor medium blend, because uh -huh. way back when, like years ago, whenever I got all of my wash like, David and the girls gave me some for a present and it was like I just squirt, I, I've always did watercolors so I squirted them all out on my palette like that so that's all of my wash and oh my goodness I know so I I've always used it like watercolor and it hasn't been fun in many ways because it's dried up and it's hard to reconstitute it because it's like the student grade regular gouache you know yes yeah, so hang on so what is what is that product that you're talking about this is i saw the it was the watercolor medium blend i forget who oh. 
watercolor yeah. medium blend so it, it it stays wet longer so i'm trying that today to see what it's like so i just squirted my palette with my water not my um essential oils <laughs> <laughs> that's what i did a couple of weeks ago so like if i i let it sit a little bit and i guess that's the with water let's see what it's like with the medium blend so i was just i bought some because i'm like well maybe that will make it where the gouache is more like what i'd want to paint with so i don't know yet okay i'll be trying it and i'll let you know yeah you'll have to let us know so at first like my other swatch it looked a little better so <laughs> um, I don't know. Okay, I gotta. Oh, Louise, okay. Louisa says she was watching a video okay. with the golden dry slower acrylics. Can you add that to? Um, you can't add that to gouache, though, can you, Louisa? I don't think so because it's acrylic based. Look for this. Any colors? <laughs> oh my. Okay, I think I've completely forgotten how to paint right now. Is what it feels like. Okay, you've forgotten how to paint. That's what it feels like. I mean, you could start with a chair and then put yourself on a chair, and you'd be fine. Did we lose her again? Ferret Duman says, "What?" Mm -hmm. okay. Are you back? I'm back. The screen had just swiped away. Like, um, like, oh, it, it had just gone blank. You know how how it does whenever you, it drives you crazy, or it drives me crazy. And, and you're in the middle of something, and then it just goes blank. That's what it did. I think it's the bad weather that we're having that's affecting your streaming. Well, there you go. Yeah, on your birthday, which isn't very fair. <laughs> no, it's not. No, it's not. It's kind of funny because um, we have a, a landline phone and it's it was from St. Louis. And like whenever we set up the landline, they gave you some kind of device to, to plug into the wall. I don't know. And um, we realized that whenever we um, were moving that all we needed to do was to plug the thing in and Chattanooga and we still have the same phone line so we do that so St. Louis gets all kinds of weather um they get um tornadoes a good bit or oh no or, or, or threats of them and uh, <laughs> so we have our landline plugged in in Chattanooga and <laughs> you're going about just two days ago um, St. Louis was having all kinds of tornado warnings that we kept hearing announcements coming on on the speaker in the room that we're going to tornado run and you need to get in the basement. And we're like, we don't have a basement. Wait a minute. This is not. This is uh, um, St. Oh, Louis. Is coming through the, the telephone? Well, the, it has an answering machine and stuff. So it's. Um, it's so, like. It's connected to an answering machine. So you would hear the. the like like you used to hear like a oh an answer machine picking up and it was telling us to take cover there's a tornado warning or a watch i for, always forget the designation but so it's kind of funny hearing that um and being in the wrong location for that to happen so <laughs> but we we didn't have bad weather oh that's good we just got like, I don't know, 10 centimeters of snow yesterday. Oh my goodness. I just yeah. how big my head was in this picture already. <laughs> I realized I'm not drawing, I'm not good at drawing hands that are not supposed to be there. Oh. Okay, I'm not going to have your hand in the picture. <laughs> I'm going to try to make my body proportional to my hand. Maybe I can just switch it around a little bit. Oh, Fiona says, Schminke has gouache retarder. Ooh. Ooh. Thank you, Fiona. 
And Fiona says, who are you streaming with? <laughs> oh, so sorry. I'm streaming with Jen Brown. And Jen has been with us for the past four years. And she, um, well, she's an architect that is uh, extremely busy right now, but has been doing lots of art with us. And it's so nice to have her on a birthday here. It's not, I'm also someone who's forgotten how to do anything. No, you don't forget how to do anything. You just... <laughs> You're just on camera, so it's like a little bit, you know, oh, you're I, under pressure. I just flipped that one over. I, I'm going to try again. Um, Fiona, Jen used to come on live stream with me a lot before. So if you go back into real, like where the reels are in my Instagram, and um, I, I should probably have tagged you jennifer brown in each of the in each of our lives or jennifer brown live with jennifer brown that's what i should go back and tag all of our live duos because um, they're like i love listening to your stories <laughs> oh who's making you a birthday cake today i don't know um, oh if, if if no one steps up i may have to so well it's different because um well, you better start right after this then, Jen. It's an old affair, isn't it? <laughs> Folks, the thing that I learned um, in a mere 50-something years is that when you cook a cake, it's important to cut the oven on and put it in the right oven. <laughs> if not, you can do it three or four times and end up with a cake at midnight. And there is a story to that, so you can go find that story. Hey, you starting again? Yes, I am. I did not what like it. What happened? So, well, I... I, I Just I needed to start life. over. <laughs> so, um, well, my oldest daughter's at school, and um, my youngest daughter, she made me take her to the store yesterday. She's like, I don't think you can figure out what it is, but don't look. <laughs> or like <laughs> I mean it's hard to, to pull off a surprise whenever you're dependent on everybody right so she's uh, 12 and so I did that and then she's been squirreled away in her bedroom the whole day with like a note on her door saying don't come in and then David and I have been having to do to figure out all kinds of stuff for the the kitchen. Like we're at the stage where we're reviewing what they call shop drawings. So the cabinet maker has sent us. Hang on, has, is this for your kitchen? No, it's for the one that the house that's under construction. Okay. So you get shop drawings and uh, since so we we have to review it and make sure that it all works and um <laughs> so in that process we uh, I was like D David was out of town for some of this and I was looking at it and I was like okay I gotta bring up the, that cabinet on the wall beside the window they've got it smaller than the, the one that we drew and then once he got here and we were looking at it together we looked at it and Wait a minute. I called the contractor to find out what the dimensions were. I mean, there, it's a, a triple window in the kitchen over the sink. So, so there's like a wall that basically is just the window, and you've got the cabinets going across the 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 that wall below the mm -hmm. sink, but nothing that's of. I mean, no wall cabinets up above, but on the sides of. What, are you going to have open cabinets, like shelves? Um, no, well, just cabinets, uh, the countertop cabinets below the countertop. And then I was hard to do this to say. So I'll show you. So if you had the, if this is the room, like a box. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So the counters here in the window is in the middle. Well, uh -huh. the supposed to be in the middle but they measured it in the middle and it was supposed to be off center and the cabinets to the side like dead into that wall and anyway the whenever we looked at it like something's not right 
and the window was built in the wrong place. <laughs> from what we so, oh no! So they're already and like they're beginning to put the the siding on the house. Next Hang week. on, whose fault was that? The 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 construction people again? I well, I th yeah, and so we were looking at it, trying to figure out. So we what you could do. Yeah, we got to figure out: Do we want them to move it? Do we want them to? Oh my gosh! These, I think you should fire this construction company. Well, well, the they fired the person who had been managing it, and the general oh, contractor. Well, the foreman. Yes. So. Oh no. We did get fired, and things are much better, and but. But this is big. That's big. That's a big problem. So. Um, they, I mean, they're, the, the guys work. Uh, okay, so everybody has responded exactly the way they need to. They, so with all the, the issues that have happened, um, I can't be more impressed with the responses. They haven't um, like butted any decision or anything like that. So they've been great. So I don't want to knock them. So they the right thing and got rid of this person but it's like this was ha happened months ago and so like the ghost of the mistakes are still here <laughs> so, wow. but anyway so david and i are figuring it out and i think it's going to actually be better for it to be oh, not good. have yeah. to move so that's good so but it made you we had to go, go back, back and look up well, how big is a KitchenAid mixer so she doesn't have to now put it someplace else or that mm. type of stuff or so well wait a minute we got to have the microwave in the wall and it sticks out how far oh we they chose the wrong microwave so we got so it's just that kind of tedious you stuff. their appliances too no you have we have to coordinate the what they purchased or what okay they purchase right make sure that it fits and is this your family, the family, the brother or sister? Yes, it's my sister-in-law. Okay. Oh, gosh. <laughs> so, but they've, they've been good. So, it's... The issues are coming other places, so... Huh. Um, uh, Fiona says, the audio always... It, it, does the audio always do this weird switching? I can only hear parts of what she is saying. Yeah, oh. you know what? We're going to have a redo of this, Fiona. Like, this is like, it's Jen's birthday, so we're doing the live, and we're both kind of um, newbies at the um, live stream on YouTube. We were so much better at this on, on Instagram, weren't we, Jen? <laughs> we were all pros. This is new territory. No. no it's quite quite pleased that we were successful in connecting so wow cam i don't think i've ever heard this is okay can i just can i just say louisa look at the comment above you this is why i do not advertise that i'm going live because we get people who make comments that don't need to be there <laughs> oh yeah you got someone that you didn't know on this well I don't know who Cam is, but, you know, they could get rid of that comment. Anyway, um, technical difficulties happen, and I'm sorry, everybody, if you're having a hard time, but we're, we're enjoying our drawing. <laughs> there is a nice comment that says, um, this, is, this art is great so far. I'm loving it. Thank you, Siberian Sage. <laughs> Hi, Amy. Well, it sounds like you guys are going to figure it out. Yeah. The the kitchen. And it's it's a lot of it is stuff that happens all the time. I mean, we have to deal with all kinds of stuff of coordinating where the outlet goes so that the it can plug in in the right spot. So, yeah. So that's it's just but I, I it'll be nice because I, it will be nice to be able to make the contractors day and say we're not going to make you move the window. So that will feel nice. Yeah. That'll be, that'll be great. So that's, that's what we've been doing. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll definitely yeah. do some of that. And, but 
yeah, I don't know what else. So I will probably be taking a nap. And I'll be going for a walk with Axel. And, is it um, so? What is it nice out there, Jen? Right now, like. I, well, it has been, and yes. Like, are you getting full spring? Like, are your are your blossoms coming through? Yes, it's beautiful. The azaleas oh, nice. popped out yesterday. Nice. And we had full blown daffodils for weeks, and they're beginning to fade. And then um, it's it's really pretty because the mountains, um, they're just uh, the trees are turning green, and so. You just see all these different dots of green, and God, I'd love it if the trees were start to turn green over here. It is so wintry; it's horrible. That's hard. It was yeah. always so difficult for me whenever I was in St. Louis because I'd grown up on the coast of South Carolina, and I mean, it was full blown spring mid March. I mean, or it seemed that way anyway. But, um, but in St. Louis, it still felt like winter, and it didn't feel like spring until much later, and it just made spring so long, <laughs> because I kept wanting it to happen, and it hadn't happened yet. Yeah, it's, um, well, na and so now in Nashville, you're further south, right? Yes, so yeah. it's real pretty. I mean, not Nashville, Tennessee. Yes. Okay. I don't know. I'm looking like a person. I don't know if I'm looking like me now. I do love it, though. I like how you're blocking in. I just sketched the whole thing. Well, that was smart. No, oh, it's not. When I'm doing these portraits, I, I, I seem to sketch them a little bit more. Because I want, I want to try and get the likeness of you guys. <laughs> well, I realize I'm painting over what I did. I'm not convinced yet, but I do like a very loose, a loose okay. image too. So, what is uh, what's happening with your chairs? Like, has it gone in a different direction? Are you still following Esty McLeod's? Um, monthly color combos? I am. I'm, I'm behind on everything. I made it to, I think, chair number 25. <laughs> so that's good. I haven't stopped. Um, and I'll keep going. So it's been burning my candle at both ends too much. But, um, yeah. but I will get there. So I have ideas for them. Um, I like the, the March prompts that you had where that seemed particularly helpful because it's I've got a couple that I'm like, oh, I need to do a cityscape. And, of course, chairs work well for interiors. and um, So those were good prompts Yeah, to be able to. Well, I mean, you could put every day this month, you could just put us all on chairs, Jen. I may do that. Y'all have sent me some chairs. If you want a chair with your portrait, <laughs> I can do it. I can put well, it on. The Padlet the is there with all of our faces in. That's right. I'll do it. Okay. I don't think that helped my head. That's Conscious, and I don't think it worked. C says, I'm enjoying the conversation and your drawing. Thank you, C. Very sweet. And Cole. Chloe Land says that looks awesome. And Fiona says, ah, okay. I thought the audio issues may be on my end. I just installed our new router yesterday. Oh. No. And Fiona <laughs> says, happy birthday. Oh, thank you. And C says, so love the full photo of your dog and you. He's adorable. Yeah. He is, Axel. How many years have you had Axel now? Did you get him the same year as we got Piper? Um, I think. Did you get him in 2020? No. We got him. The weekend that I met Pearly. Um, so I think we've had him two years now. So we were a little late to the game. My daughter was like, if you don't get him, you're never going to get him all in school. <laughs> so I think we've had him two or three years. Okay, so okay. Um, he. Poor guy. He. 
couple of weeks, uh, about a week ago, he was coughing con almost continuously and um, like he was going to throw up and it was only like, um, foam that was coming up and he, he didn't ever, it wasn't ever, he never threw up. He was just acting pitiful. So I took him to the vet and apparently I uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. But he hasn't been around any other dogs, and the only thing the vet could figure was is that um we have coyotes around here, and he he is a little rat part rat terrier, so uh -huh. he puts his nose in anything, and I think he's like smelled coyote poop or something, and got it that way. It's the only thing that we could figure. Oh, maybe. Do you give him the, we, we give um, Piper the, the vaccination for kennel cough every year. Do you guys do that over there? We haven't done that because he's never been to the Right, because you, yeah. Oh, no, it's like from any other dogs. Like, it doesn't have to be from, because my, my sister's dog in England, he got it, and he's, he's never been in a kennel. Well, but, I think we may have to begin doing that because... I didn't like him having to go through that. He's much better. The pills made him happy, and he was happy to have a peanut butter treat to eat them. I had to learn the skill of wrapping the peanut butter pills. I know. They're sneaky, eh? They know, they know what is a pill and what's not a pill. Yep. Okay. I'm having to let oh. Hmm. What color background should I? Green? Um, I don't know. I've done a blue one. Green would be nice. Yeah, maybe. I don't know. What's your favorite color? Red. I'm wearing a red shirt. So maybe I'll do some green. If I get the right green. I don't know what. I'm squirting my gouache again. Oh, you're you're spraying it. With this, because I like those little um, those little containers with the pans and then the silicone top that squishes over the top of them. I don't have one of those, but I think I may, I may get one. Have you seen those? No, I haven't heard of those. Okay. I think Sarah linked it in our group chat once. Um, if anybody else knows the name of those, you can get them on Amazon. Um, Shivam also told us about one in one of Beth's meets that he was using. It's like a little square and you put your gouache in and it stays wet, which is really good. Oh, uh oh. Louisa says, hmm, my comments stop commenting. Oh, no, ignore me. <laughs> just keep drawing. Keep painting. Just keep drawing. Just keep drawing. Well, did you get to celebrate your birthday well? Um... Yeah, we yeah. went out for dinner. Uh -huh. And we yeah, we went out for dinner. We went to have um Japanese sushi, which is one of my favorite types of food. I also went out for lunch with some girlfriends of mine and we went um to Indian, which was really nice and had Indian food. Do you like Indian food, Jen? I haven't had much of your food, so I want to. I should try it. Now I have to report back. So, in um, Chattanooga, there's not many Indian restaurants. Well, we haven't gone. Um, I don't know what's here. So, um, yeah, we haven't gone out much. I guess is the best answer. So, we've um, we like Middle Eastern. Um, we've gone there. Yeah. Um, 
Okay, so Middle Eastern and East Indian, I mean, there is a little bit of a difference, but you'll still get like spices and it's very flavorful. Okay. Yeah. And you don't have to, like, if you don't really like spicy, you don't have to have it too spicy. You just ask for it like mild or whatever. Oh, okay. Well, that's yeah. Because I think some people are a bit wary of it. They think it's all going to be spicy. Um, Julie says, today is Bethco working session, by the way. Oh, thank you. What time is that, Julie? And Sleepy Ears says, Hill. Not sure what that means. And Hat says, I feel like the one on the left would not hesitate to end me. See, we, we're getting some really strange, odd people here today, which we don't usually. I don't think, Louisa, I am not going to like make it known to people that I'm going to be live at 7 a.m. in the morning anymore. I'm like, nope, that ain't happening. I prefer it when it's just, you know, hanging out with the friends. Shah, don't comment. <laughs> Julie says, Shah, don't comment. Mm -hmm. I'm just not used to it, you know? Yeah. Okay. And it's obviously my it's obviously my drawing that it's like, you know, they're um having feelings with. Nothing on reflection of you, Jen, because the, you know, they <laughs> my drawing doesn't actually look like you right now. <laughs> Mine doesn't either. <laughs> There's no fear of like revealing who we are. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know if I want to use that color. That would make me look gray and washed out. Not not wanting to do that. Not right now. For some reason when I saw Axel, I'm like, wasn't didn't he have any white on him? Has he never had any white on him? Has he always oh. been just gray? Um, this his his hair is really short in this picture, and okay. whenever it's longer, he looks half white and gray. Okay, so maybe that's why I'm like, did you get a new dog? <laughs> no, <laughs> it's, it's the the length of his hair. He looks he looks completely different right now. So it was fun to to see him with the short right hair okay. again. Oh, my screen started to fade. No, it's dead. Mm, oh, I, okay. I got to redeem my portrait. I, this is humbling. My hair is not that big ever. <laughs> oh, I think I made your hair quite big. <laughs> no, it was funny. Yesterday I went to the salon and they asked, um, like I my hair styled and they were like, would you like smooth or, or, Big or fluffy, and I was like, or, I forget what the word they said. I was like, oh, I'll go fluffy. Oh my goodness, I felt ridiculous the whole day. <laughs> <laughs> so the way they blow dried it or sprayed it, it yeah, made it yeah. feel like it was away from my scalp and like a bouncing helmet the whole day. <laughs> oh my gosh. I know, isn't it funny how like just by them blow drying it a certain way, it can feel completely different, like. And I know the thing is with my hairdresser, she's a friend of mine. So I say to her now, like, I'll just dry it. I'll dry it how I dry it. Because every time she dries it, I feel completely different when I come out of her. I feel like a different person, but not in a good way. Like, it's like, yeah. no, this is weird. Like, it doesn't feel like me. Like, I look in the mirror and I'm like, oh, my gosh. Like, I, it looks like I have an updo. I'm like, I'm not that person to have an updo. Mm -hmm. So I like the idea of looking better, but I don't <laughs> think I'm like, no, I can't do that. But you probably looked really very pretty. Like it, it was probably something that did did your husband turn around and go, hey, Jen, no, you're looking old. This time he's like, that does look more helmet. <laughs> like there <laughs> was more of like a, I don't know, a more typical look and it was someone different doing that part so mm. um, and most of the time I don't do that much to my own hair so it was just kind of funny oh Jen it's looking great yours 
<laughs> and I'm sitting here thinking like, why is she's not going to want me to paint with her anymore? <laughs> no, it's looking great. Like you blocked it all in. It's actually, I'm going to, I'm starting to block Axel in now and block mine in because I'm like, I need to get moving and I only have 15 minutes. I'm going to be working on yours all day. Yeah. Well, I'm sure your family has um, <laughs> things for you to do other than work. Uh, yeah, I'm sure. We'll are you Are you going out for dinner, or is somebody cooking you dinner? Well, um, we may go. We may go out someplace. So I don't know. It was funny because someone, a relative, couldn't come in town the way they had planned, and they had these um, tickets to a. Com comedian at a church uh -huh. that we're not familiar with. And I'm like, no, <laughs> that's not what I want to do for my birthday. <laughs> they was like, let me check with Jen. I'm like, no, that's not what I want to do. <laughs> not something that you want to do. Yeah, so I don't know what we'll do, but we won't be. I mean, going to listen to a comedian as long as they're funny, it can be very, <laughs> it can be a great evening. Right. Well, I did. I wasn't convinced that I think the same things were funny. So, um. Anyway, so I didn't. That's true. Yeah. Humor, humor is a funny thing. Everybody has different humor. Yes. It sounds like you're on an airplane. I have no idea what our what our sound is doing today. It's, honestly, Jen, listen back to it because it's it's quite funny. It sounds like you're like flying and you keep you've got like a headset on and it keeps going <laughs> in and out of like I'm not sure. Maybe mine's doing the same thing. Is mine doing the same thing, everybody? You sound clear to me. So really? Flying through, flying through turbulence. Yes. <laughs> everyone. <laughs> I know. Uh, C says, I don't think we have seen the full figure of Axel. No, I don't think we have either. Like, I think this is new to us, which is really nice. Oh, yeah. He's a cute little dog. And C says, I like the relaxed posture that you captured, Jen. Yeah, I do too. Jen's very good at it. No, it's only Jen's audio, Fiona oh. said. Oh dear, sorry. No, no, it's okay. We'll, you know what? We're we're gonna figure this out. You're gonna come back. It's gonna be like a, a fresh start. We'll get Jen on as many times as it takes <laughs> I'll, I'll <laughs> until be, we figure this out. You can be my guinea pig. We'll figure it out together. I'll be ninety nine by the time we get it done, right? <laughs> no, you won't. In in one year is what I mean. <laughs> Not the, oh oh, you mean like it's it'll it'll age you. No, no, like it might, like if I did it for my birthday, like it might take us 99 attempts to get it right. So I might be the age. Listen, I, it doesn't have to be just a birthday. So, you know, okay, that's when, you, when you're when you free and you want to paint, just, you know, message me and we'll try and figure it out. I, I okay. And this lot that's watching, they, they have a lot of patience with us. So they don't mind sitting through, sitting through this. <laughs> Look at Axel. Oh my goodness, you made him adorable. Oh I need I need to I need to make him adorable. He's he is adorable. I'm not sure about your hand, but hey, and I'm not sure about the color of your face either. This is what happens when I leave a palette as well. Usually what I do is take fresh paint for the face and I didn't do that today but I am going to later because I like it when it's a little bit thicker and you're right like using it from the dry palette here it gets like really watery yes so I keep having trouble especially with my face because, because it's too wet and it starts bleeding so yeah um, so what I think I will just keep my my dirty palettes for backgrounds and big areas and then I'll mix up new colors for, for um, like facial colors and things like that. Good strategy. And it's good to think through it that way because. And that's helpful because I don't think I quite realized what exactly was happening, but that's, I think you nailed it. Yeah, just because when you spray water on, it gets watery, but it doesn't, it doesn't really soften the whole um, blob of 
of um, gouache, right? So right. you're not really doing much other than just making a water film over the top of all your colors. Right. But you don't want to waste them either. I know. <laughs> so there's a fine line. Like right now, your face looks orange, but it's not actually like that in my eyes. In like in the in the real image that I've got in front of me. Well, maybe you are. Maybe I need to lighten your face skin a little bit. You're looking a little bit crazy. <laughs> and maybe I should change my brush to a smaller brush. I'm going to try getting my hands to match the color of my face. Maybe. I always get like bits of... Are any of your daughters up yet? <laughs> no one's awake. No one's awake yeah, so for your live for your live here. No one is awake. I did not advertise to them. <laughs> <laughs> I advertised. It. Well, I no, they knew. I did advertise. To them. But I didn't wake them up for it. It's not like, oh, you gotta come see me. Why not? No. <laughs> that would be intimidating. Yeah. yeah. Um, Julie says, I think next time anyone from the group is getting a new pet, we need to advocate for another color than gray, or I need to get something better at rendering gray pet furs. Yeah, that could be, that could be a, a good idea. That's a good point. Yeah. Uh, I, th I think it's also a good point. Of Squirting out fresh paint. It's not wasted when you do that. No. I, I, yeah, it just changed. Even the white, like it just, you don't get the same white, like when you're using it from, from dry to um, like putting water on it. It just doesn't feel the same. Yep. Okay. I'm getting more yellow. It's not. Um, faded away, and I had to punch in my passcode again to get access to my phone. So I'm back. Oh, Louisa says I have a non-gray pigeon. Oh, well, we'll paint the pigeon. And Julie Come says up. I hope Axel won't mind my drawing of him. I'm sure. <laughs> um, Louisa, have you added a picture yet to the Padlet? I think we have enough pictures anyway for the next few days, which is good. Okay, so I added yellow to my fresh tab of yellow. Now none of my greens match anymore. I like my other green better. How am I going to do this? Oh, that is bright green. I know. I like the other one. <laughs> uh, you can just mix some red into it. Um, Julie, you know the session with um, Beth. Do we have to be a member, just a member of Beth's uh, Substack, or do we have to be a member also of um, Sarah Dyer's? Can somebody tell me? Because I think I may need to come to that work session because I have a lot of work to do. I'm nervous about doing my face. Tash says, oh, Louisa says, no, she hasn't added, um, but I bagged a day. Oh, good. Okay. And Julie says, oh, I spoke too quickly. Wait until you see my pet's color. Is it gray as well? <laughs> Tash <laughs> says, was sick today, but gonna add photo of me and my puppy tomorrow. That's great. No, no rush, Tash. We have a few for, for um. <coughs> we have a few for a few days, so we're good. We have 
lots of pets in here. Well, our um, my the art classes I teach with my girls that is for co-op, and the semester ends. I think the last day is the twenty third of April. Oh, oh wow, that's early, isn't it? Yeah. But um, <laughs> but there, this is the first year we're having a year-end show. So oh, that's cool. So they're wanting us to set up an art show. So we we've known about it the whole year. We finally have an answer. We we have concrete block walls. Nothing to it's the church building that doesn't belong to us. Oh. So we don't have freedom to just do whatever we want to the walls. And so I've been, we've been asking the whole time, okay, we're happy to do an art show, but tell us how we can display them. And um, finally, the other art we came up with the plan. So we found black foam cord boards, like 20 inch by 30, and we're taping them together like a book. Oh, and so oh. we're going to set them up on tables and the kids can have their um, artwork. Their artwork on the tables? Yeah, pasted on their own foam core book. So so they'll be propped up, kind of like a science fair. Oh, yeah, neat. So, <laughs> so it was like last Tuesday when we had our free period, the teacher and I were like, Okay, this is what we can do. So we told the the people, the leaders who were like, this is what we need to do. This will work. And they're like, we're going to meet about it. And then they gave us the okay to do the foam core. And we had Googled it and we had found it like at the Dollar Tree, Dollar like 25 per board. And we can do this. And she, she needed like 28 boards. She went, she lives in a particular area where there were a lot of, she found the Dollar Tree and she went and she bought all 28 boards. I had to Google a Dollar Tree and find every, it kept coming up with Dollar General and they didn't have it or whatever. Every other place. I needed a Dollar Tree. So I had to drive two or three places to find a Dollar Tree. And every one I went to did not have those boards. I was like, you're kidding me. Oh I, couldn't, I couldn't find them. And so, yes, I found one close. Yes, I found one, and we went to it, and I, I needed 22 boards, and I went, and I found them in this particular Dollar Tree. It was like 30 minutes from my house, and I counted, and number 21, I looked, and it had gunk on it, no. and, <laughs> and then I looked, and there was another one, so I bought up all of the foam core, so now we've got foam core, and I'm having the symbol the boards so we'll see what it's like so that effectively kept me from painting my face it's dry now <laughs> wow <laughs> so, so it'll be that's fine. a lot yeah i don't know if people know jen also teaches throughout the year she teaches what is it like just homeschooled kids it's like a homeschool program yes it's a co-op where um if you're homeschooling you can you teach a class, you're, you're, well, part of the deal at the end of part of the co op is you need to help um, with or serve for the school in some way. So, yeah. the way that I do it is I teach art for the fourth fifth graders. Um, and I assist with the um, middle and high school art class. Okay, now I can see. Too tall. That's what I was doing. I've been trying to get that head right the whole time. Now I can see. Oh, how, like oh, your like forehead, you mean? Yeah, you can see it, can't you? <laughs> so that's yeah, funny. a little bit. But before you had your your eyebrows too high up on your. But yeah. I I wasn't going to say anything because I didn't know where you were going with it. Like I don't, you know, yeah. you can't really say too much until somebody's finished. <laughs> Right. So I'm, I'm getting there. <laughs> I think it looks great, Jen. So I think, I think. I started off with my head too small. Now I think my head's, or no, head too big. Now I think my head's too small. 
for well, this body. <laughs> well, yeah, maybe. <laughs> yeah, maybe. You're right. <laughs> oh my goodness. You're right. <laughs> I'm not gonna I'm not gonna deny that, but that's okay. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is hilarious. It doesn't <laughs> look bad. <laughs> I'll cut out a new one. I, was I mean, it just looks like you've got a really big dog. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, that's really funny. Oh my goodness. Uh, this is bizarre. Well, what I'm going to be doing today is painting myself all day because it's going to take me a full 24 hours to get this thing right. Well, no, you've got work to do. You can't. <laughs> this is what it is. It I is guess. what it is. You can correct it at another day. That's right. Oh. And I never wear red lipstick like that. You never wear red? Red lipstick. Oh, red lipstick. <laughs> and you put red lipstick on your... <laughs> Getting rid of that. Smearing that off. Yeah. Oh my goodness. And this, folks, this is what you don't do. <laughs> <laughs> what to do and what not to do at 7 a.m. in the morning. You guys all remember, like, are you 7 a.m. too, Jen? Yes. yes or are you, oh, you are. How come Beth is, like, an hour different from you? Well, Tennessee's long. Tennessee is long. Tennessee is yes. long. You're yes. just in, you're di in different time zones. That's crazy. Well, and Chattanooga is at the very edge of the time zone that we're in. So... Oh, you yes, you've told us. So you can drive like 20 minutes and then be in another time zone. That's right. So well, that's super confusing. You're right. The vet that we took Axel to was in the oh, other Oh, yes. And, and you arrived late. Was that it? We, we actually arrived early and we're like, why are we early? Because we were in a different time, time zone. So it does work to your advantage, though, if your garbage disposal goes out at nine o'clock at night and you don't realize it, you can go to Lowe's in Georgia before they close at 10 and come back and fix your disposal before it's 10 o'clock or so. It was, it was bizarre. So oh. we were able to go and get the part in Georgia before it closed because the time was different, or I, I don't know. <laughs> if your husband was awake now, he'd be correcting everything you're saying. You're right. <laughs> he'd be like, no, Jen, it would be like this. It was like this. That's right. I, I cannot do time zones. And when we were in St. Louis, Louis, this over spring break, we had to deal with the time zone changed just because of travel. Uh -huh. The time changed while we were there. And I was like, I don't know what time it is, and I can't figure it out. <laughs> he could. I can't. That is not my skill. Well, you just have to look at your watch or your, no, look at your phone, and that will tell you the actual time of where you are. That is what I did. So I could not think about it anymore. Correct. Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, I've got a successfully made my face white, and I'm scared to do anything else because it's so wet. Well, then just wait. I think our, our time is up anyway. I'm sure you're like, oh my gosh, thank goodness, let me get out of here. But <laughs> it was really lovely having you on today, Jen. And I'm sorry for all the tech issues that we've had, everybody. Um, it's still lovely to have you here and see you painting. And I think I have to change your nose and your face and everything. Well, you, you're making me look pretty good. So thank you. Well, I haven't finished it. I will finish it today. <laughs> I started with half, uh, half a, um, background and <laughs> Sophia says, did you, oh my gosh, you're such a good artist. Thank you so much. That's so sweet. 
And Louisa says, that's a very specific example, Jen, LOL. I'm not <laughs> sure what specific example. Oh, she has the opposite problem. Oh, just do big hair. I think I'm reading them a little bit late, but Rosalie says, hi, Char and everyone. We're here with Jen. We're actually just about to leave. It's Jen's birthday today. So have a really, really lovely, lovely day. And um, I mean, I love what I'm seeing on yours. I think it's great. Did you just go over the face again? <laughs> no, I. Um, You're waiting for it to dry, right? I'm waiting for it to dry, and I kind of made my body a little less big. With my, I painted up under my armpit. Yeah. I don't think you need to worry about it. I think it's fine, Jen. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Everything yeah. I'll get there. I hope. Yeah. Rosalie says, happy birthday, Jen. Well, thank you. Thank and you C everybody. says, love both. Oh, and you. Sophia says, happy birthday, Jen. Thank you. Um, yeah, enjoy your day. Let us know where they take you for dinner. Maybe they'll take you to, East, to eat some East Indian food. That would be fun. I would enjoy it. I will let you know what I have. Well, maybe you should just eat what you love and know what you love, because if not, it'll be one of those. But it'll turn into a beautiful story, which we will, which we will hear the next time. That's right. Always a story. There's I like your pot. What is that pot? It was that raspberry jam. The we we, where your oh, water is. Yes. So we like. My daughter likes the wee jars, and they're or the wee raspberry. That's the good one. The, the oh, tea. is it jam or is it like a yogurt? It's a yogurt and it comes in a little glass container and it has aluminum foil so you're not... Oh, so cool. And now you've got nice little jars. We use them all the time for everything. Um, Very nice. So, But the raspberry and the, the key lime are really good. The others, well, there's some that aren't good. And the, the chocolate ones, the chocolate and vanilla is good. And the vanilla and the honey. So <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like they're all good. Yeah. <laughs> she has a list of which ones for me to buy. <laughs> so. Awesome. Well, thank you. Thank you so much. And everyone, thank you for joining. And I will see. Oh, by the way, check your Patreon uh, messages this morning. I will be sending out. A meet. I know I was supposed to send it out last night and then I fell asleep, so I will be sending that out ASAP. We are going to be doing still lives tomorrow at 10.30 a.m. for our sketch and draw. Take care, everybody. All right. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. Thank you.